Here we are at our 2017 StarCraft 2321 rental fleet boat unit number three for sale here on Norris Lake. This does include a trailer. We will have the current asking price as well as the engine hours listed at our website, which is www.yournewboat.com. Once you make it to our website, you'll see the orange letter, and that's how you'll know you're at the right place. Click the Find Your New Boat button and scroll down. You'll see all of our inventory is order of price. Scroll down until you see the 2017 StarCraft 2321 bow rider unit number three for sale. You'll see the asking price right there. You'll be able to click into the listing, see a photo slideshow of it, printable PDF to, your, to the left hand side of that page. Of course, all of our contact information will be right there, and that's where you'll want to reach out to us with any questions or to schedule a viewing of this one. You can contact us by phone, by text, by email. If you ever call our voicemail and uh, or ever call our phone and get a voicemail and would like a return phone call, leave a detailed message. We'll be happy to do so as soon as we get back in cell phone range because if we do not answer, it's likely because we do not have cell phone reception. We're often in areas around Norris Lake without any. This is powered by a Merc Cruiser 6.2 liter, 300 horsepower inboard outboard. Stern drive engine, that is our Bravo 3 out drive right there. And as you can see, we've got an extended swim boarding ladder with our extended swim platform with a swim boarding ladder. That's a three step swim boarding ladder. And you can also see we're missing that little cap right over there. This one is rated for 12. Do have a Wakeboard tower with tower mount bimini top. There is uh, snapping carpeting is available with this boat. It will be a new condition. It has not been rented with the uh, carpeting. Those stay in the uh, bags in the plastic. Basically, they haven't been pulled out since this boat was delivered. It has been rented for two rental seasons. We do anticipate around 500 hours on the engines, but we'll have the exact hours listed at our website. So here at your helm station, we do have battery voltmeter, engine water temp. Uh, engine out drive trim gauge, oil pressure, tachometer, speedometer, fuel gauge, 12 volt power outlet. Do you have some courtesy lights? This is an AM FM, a USB auxiliary input, Bluetooth capable stereo. We've got four stereo speakers, nine cup holders. Do you have a pair of swivel bucket seats? Large in floor ski locker right there. Walk through transom up to our, our open bow. We've got anchor storage here. Pair of cup holders there. Another cup holder on either side of your bow. So you got a total of four of those nine up here in the bow area. All your uh, seats are on hinges here, which makes it very handy for getting things in and out. Three more cup holders back here, and then one at your driver and passenger seat. There's that 6.2 liter Merc Cruiser, 300 horsepower stern drive engine. This will be fastened there. They'll pull that off whenever they winterize these to get to the water drains on the engine. You've also got a remote oil filter. Doesn't really mean anything other than that oil filter is kind of somewhere a little bit more handy rather than being down on the side of the engine block. Do you have some, uh, a tear on the vinyl here? And for the most part, I've kind of given a once over to the other areas and have not noticed um, any other vinyl damage you do have uh, this pad right here is coming out around that trim i really like how that battery is battery is accessible right there fairly easily here's your wakeboard toe attachment and then for tubes you'd want to use this one right back here Yeah, I'm going to climb off. Try to show you the areas of wear and tear that we've noticed. We do have the rub rail that's coming, coming off on both rear corners of the section along with some fiberglass 
works and some uh, or fiberglass work to be done and some dock rash around on this one. There's that Bravo one out drive. I think I've already shown you that one. We've also got this must be vinyl decaling here on the bottom of this boat near the water line and that's peeling up on both sides as well. And let me try to show you the rear port side corner. Right over here, same thing, that decaling is coming up on the back of this one and you got some rub rail to repair back here as well. So that's gonna wrap things up here for the 2017 StarCraft 2321 bow rider for sale on Norris Lake with trailers. This has been unit number three. Thank you again for joining us. Visit our website for more information.